hey everybody i know it is late i know it is late um well it's not that late it's 9 48 just getting finished working not too long ago and decided to cut off all my hair y'all because it's getting hot but i didn't come on live just to talk about my hair i came on live um because i am needing you guys help for me to reach my goal for our women's day um women's day jubilee um we are our spots for the vendors are filling up i'm excited about that we are almost complete with that but i'm needing some sponsors i want you guys to to help me um with making this a great success um for some ladies i know it's late so people are not tuned in yet or whatever but you could do this on a replay um I never really ask for anything, but I'm asking for this. So if you know I'm asking, then you know it's very, very, very important. Um, again, I want this to be such a great success. Um, I've been having vendors hit me up left and right. We have a few spots available, um, so I'm excited about that. But I am definitely looking for some sponsors, um, personal sponsors, or if you're a part of a business, your business, and you want to sponsor and make a donation for our Women's Day Jubilee, um, I will be so appreciative of that because, again, I want this to be such a great success. I know I look tired, y'all. Um, I'm loving my hair, though, guys. But, yes, this is what I'm coming on live tonight. Um, and I would have came earlier, but when I say I was busy, I was busy. Um, and I, like I said, I don't never, ever, ever ask for a lot from anybody. And it's not for me. It's not for me. It's for the Women's Day Jubilee. Um, and I'm just coming, like I said, live because I want this to be a, such a great success. Um, on this live, I posted um, my cash app. I posted the amount for the tickets. So if you have any special lady in your life and you want her to be around some powerful women that is entrepreneurs, um, we're going to be doing networking. We're going to be shopping and supporting each other businesses. We're going to be empowering each other. We're going to be motivating each other. We're going to help each other get through that breakthrough purpose or part of um, our lives where we can walk into to our purpose so these are the things that we're going to be doing um this is something you don't see a whole lot in um our city in our town it's not about clicks it's not about any of that um any walk of life a woman is um welcome the tickets are 25 dollars, y'all 25 dollars. the vendor fee is 50 dollars if you want to bring somebody to help you, it's $25 for them. I'm looking for all my vendors to participate as well. So you're not just going to be setting up at the table and sitting there and waiting for people to come and purchase your items. You're also going to be a part of these activities that we're going to be having. I'm also, again, like I said, looking for sponsors. Um, there is no little donation. Anything that you want to bless um, the Women's Day um jubilee with i will be so grateful i know my eyes look heavy and tired because i am tired i just been working 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 outside of just working and doing hair throughout the day in between my clients um life coaching um trying to get everything situated with the women's day jubilee um this is very this is something that's very near and dear and precious to my heart and again like i said if you can be a sponsor for these ladies i would greatly appreciate it you're not doing it for me personally i'm not taking any of the funds and putting in my pocket any of our sponsors um that want to uh bless the women's day jubilee um what we will be doing is i'm getting with um demetrius and he's going to get with me and he's going to put like a mini type commercial um together where we'll be broadcasting and saying who our sponsors are who our vendors are because i when i I say I appreciate everybody so far that have uh, contribute to this Women's Day Jubilee. I'm just excited about it because these are the things that I've been wanting to do for a long time, a long time. And now here it is, it's manifesting. Now it's coming uh, to life. So I'm, I'm, I have a passion for this. I have a passion and a love for women that are in a stronghold relationships or stronghold situations or broken um yes ma'am you can shahida buy a ticket the tickets are 25 dollars um what i'm needing is when you do purchase a ticket my cash app is on here 
cash app it to me and then in the $25 put ticket um ticket for event so that way um because all the funds that's been coming in with the vendors and everything all of these funds are going towards the women day jubilee um so that i can rent the tables and purchase the tents and everything uh with the decorations the um the packets and all of that stuff so all of this stuff is um this is what this funds are going for okay babe okay i appreciate it and like i said for our sponsors if you cannot um be a part of the event i would appreciate if you would make a donation towards this event no men are not allowed at this event this is event strictly for women i want to do something strictly for you and the reason i want to do that is because a lot of times we as women and i know i used to be so guilty of this we as women we put ourselves on the back burners um especially mothers wives even girlfriends um we put ourselves on the back burner and we take care of everybody else but we never ever 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 really take that time out for ourselves to pamper ourselves to um show ourselves appreciation we really don't do that so this is the time this right here is where we're going to be taking time out for just us just strictly us so i want the vendors and and nothing nothing against you men we're going to have other events where it's going to be how they call it co-ed or whatever where it's men and women but this one right here the women's day jubilee is strictly put together for us as women so when i say these vendors are stepping up and stepping out and it's going to be something so awesome we're going to be videotaping and we're going to be recording and we're going to take pictures for our memories so i could put on my web website page again i want to make a shift in the atmosphere i just don't want to make a statement and i'll be posting my pictures with little statements and quotes and and encouraging everybody but this right here is a movement this is the first this is the beginning whether we're going to break generational curses we are going to break those strongholds we're going to break those chains that's holding us back from really walking into our gift and in our purpose shahida i just got your cash app babe i appreciate you so much for your love and support she always 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 anything that i ask her for she always come through and do it so if you ladies want to be there listen all you have to do is you have to cash at me it's 25 but when you cash app and put 25 dollars make sure you put for event so that way like i said the funding that comes through my cash app it will be posted towards um to take care of all of the expenses for the women's day jubilee i know y'all probably saying well misha you hosted something and you can't pay for it. this like i said the tickets is for um your your seat your table um, it's also for the food. We're going to have food there. We're going to have activities there. So these are the things that's going to cover that. The vendor fee is $50. That includes one table and one chair. If you want to bring a guest with you, they will have to pay the $25 for a ticket. We only have 50 tickets because with COVID and we're doing on the outside. So with our vendors, you're welcome to bring a tent because we don't know if it's going to be real hot that day. You're welcome to bring a tent and you can decorate it however you choose. Now, I did have a set time from two to five, but listen. We're not paying anybody for a venue. So if we run over, we run over. We get happy up in there and excited and we have things going on. And it most likely, you know us women, we will get together. We begin to have a good time. We begin to talk. We begin to laugh and it will run over. But it's fine. It is fine. We're not going to stop it. We're not going to make you rush home and run home. This is something that I want to put together because, again, a lot of women that I talk to, a lot of women that I counsel that sit in my chair to get their hair done, a lot of women don't have an outlet. A lot of women don't have that special time just for them or they could mix and mingle with other women that are going through what they went through or have already gone through it. So these are the things that we're going to be doing. We're going to be dealing with. We're going to do a segment called Cast Your Cares. And when I say this is this is something God gave me when i say this something right here is just between you and god but we're going to be doing it as a group we're going to be doing a speak it speak it and speaking life into your life whatever it is that you want god to do for you you're going to write it down write the vision and make it plain and you're going to begin to speak it out loud because god is going to move on your behalf from that day all the way up into the rest of your life but you got to begin to walk in faith and not in fear and these are the things that we're going to be doing 
at this Women's Day Jubilee. God gave me the title for it. And when I then when I looked up June 19th and it said Jubilee, a day of Jubilee, meaning a day of freedom. So that's what we're doing. We're breaking strongholds. We're breaking that strong bond that's holding you hostage mentally. A lot of us are slaves in our own mind. We overthink everything. I know I was guilty of it and just even recently guilty of that. And it's a day by day, step by step pro um, process. So I'm here to let you women know the ones that are suffering in silence, you are not alone. And we're going to be putting different activities together, not just the women um, day jubilee, the women, yeah, the women's day jubilee, but we're going to also have retreats set up that we can come together. And like I said, we got to have a limit to it because with the COVID going on and everything, but we're going to be praying that God lift that and remove this plague that's going on so that we can do more things like travel outside of the country. These are the things that I really truly um, wholeheartedly want to do. My kids are grown now, so I don't have little babies or anything holding me back. But when I did have my babies at home, it was only so much you can do. And a lot of women still have kids at home or they're raising their grandchildren. Um, now I'm not raising my grandkids, but I do financially help with them. But still, nevertheless, we always put ourselves on the back burner. So this is what we're going to be doing for the Women's Day Jubilee. So I come to you. I come before you on tonight at 959 Accent. If you would love to be a sponsor for this event, there is no gift too small or too great. The more the merrier. <laughs> cash app it to me and make sure that you put if you go doing it to be a sponsor put sponsor on there if it's for your business if it's for your business my phone acting up if it's for your business make sure you put your business name or inbox me and say hey misha this is such and such i just cash app you and your name will pop up and then i will give you a shout out for your business i also will send you a receipt so that you can write this off on your taxes as well. If you are purchasing a ticket, the tickets are $25 per ticket. Hit me up in my inbox. Let me know. Hey, Misha, I want such and such amount of tickets. I will send you the information. It's on this live as well. But I will send you the information. And then um, you can send me the cash app on how many ever tickets you want. I will put that amount of tickets under your name. Again, we have limited seating because of COVID and everything. If you want a vendor, we still have some vendor spots available. That's $50 that will cover your table and your chair. You can decorate it however you choose to with your pro products, your merchandise. And you're welcome to bring a tent as well because June 19th, it probably is going to be hot outside. Um, I'm in the process of getting some shirts made. We want to be comfortable. We're not coming dressed in our sundresses like we did on last year. No, we're going to have some, when I say some stuff going on that day, we're going to have some exercises. And I'm not talking about physical exercises where we're going to be running in place and all of that. But I'm talking about we're going to get ready to do some stuff, y'all. We're going to be walking around the walls of Jericho, tearing down those things that's holding us hostage and bondage i'm excited y'all i don't know about y'all but i am excited and i'm going to continue to come forth and talk about this event because i want to keep it in your face i don't want you to forget about this save the date june 19th 2021 from two to five but again like i said we're not going to cut it off we're not going to cut it off. If God say, y'all keep on going, we're going to keep on going. We're going to have some awesome and great speakers, speakers, powerful women that's going to be speaking the truth and the, nothing but the truth. And that's what we want. We want some raw stuff. We don't want nothing that's going to be, um, how can I say, um, like we just sat up there and we rehearsed it. No, however God bring it here, however God bring it here, I want it to flow out your mouth just like that, just like that. So that's what we're getting ready to do. So again, the Women's Day Jubilee is a day of freedom. That's where no matter whether you marry, single, widow, divorce, a single mother, um, no children, a house full of children, grandmother, not a grandmother. It does not matter. Whatever you're wrestling with and struggling with, that's what we're going to be dealing with on that particular day. So I'm excited about it. Again, if you want to purchase a ticket for you, your friend, your sister, your grandma, your auntie, this is an all women's event. No men allowed at this event y'all this is strictly strictly for my sisters this is strictly for 
you. This is a day that you're going to be pampering yourself. You're going to treat yourself. You're going to love yourself. You're going to love your sisters. I don't care if you know them or you don't know them. It does not matter. We still are walking the same path. We still have the same struggles. So it's time for us to get out of that mindset that, you know, hey, I got mine. Now you get yours. You may be strong in one area and your sister may be weak in the other area. But nevertheless, hey, Miss Tisa, how you doing, my love? Hi, Lioness. Hey, Tangie. Listen, this is what we're going to be doing at the Women's Day Jubilee. So again, if you want to purchase the ticket, we have limited um, seating. The tickets are $25. My cash app is on here. If you miss it out and you want to do a replay, do replay it, get the information. But if you need more information, you can hit me up in my inbox and I will definitely send the information to you. The tickets, again, is $25. The vendor fee is $50. If you would like to be a sponsor and you're out of the state of Florida, or if you're in a way different part of Florida, it does not matter. You can play a part as well. You can send me um, your cash app. Well, I'll send you my cash app. You send me what you want to sponsor and donate towards the Women Day Jubilee. But make sure on that cash app you put sponsor. I will send you a screenshot so that you can use that as a receipt. And if you are a just a person, I will give you a shout out. If you are a business, I will give you a shout out. And if you need a letter or anything like that um, outside of the screenshot, showing that you made a donation towards something i will do that as well so that you can turn around and you can file it on your taxes again guys you know i don't come asking for anything but this is something that's so near and dear to my heart and with me talking to women every single day i work seven days a week doing hair and every single day i'm meeting somebody and talking to somebody that is wrestling with something and feeling like they're not worthy and this is why I'm putting this together to show us as women, we can love each other. We can support each other. We can encourage each other. We can motivate each other. We can uplift each other. Something that we don't do. We've been trained from our ancestors that no, we play each other against each other. You play the dark against the light. You play the skinny against the fat. You play the rich against the poor. It does not matter. When you are a daughter of God, it does not matter about your size. It does not matter about your color. It does not matter about your money. It does not matter. So this is where we're going to come together all on one accord for the same purpose and the same reason. And that is to uplift each other and to build each other. So again, if you want to play a part, whether it's to come and be a part of the activities, come on, $25 for the ticket. If you want to come and you want to be a vendor, it's $50 for the vendor fee. Come on, be a part of it. If you want to be a sponsor, come on and be a part of it. Either way, play a part in this. This is something that we, we, and not just black women, but more so my sisters, listen, this is something we need. This is something we need to do like right now. Too many times, like I said, it's about these clicks going on. God ain't about no click. God ain't about what you got. He don't care nothing about that. It's time for us to step up out of that. It's time for us to get this little snootiness that we have about each other, how we look down at each other. It ain't even about that. This right here, Women's Day Jubilee, is we're coming on one accord. Everybody coming in their t-shirts, either their jeans or their shorts. It does not matter. And we come in to have a good time and have a breakthrough. So if you feel like you're going to break down and cry, take them lashes off, honey. Take off the makeup. We ain't coming to be all purified for each other. No, we just coming sister to sister to encourage and, emo and, and um, motivate each other. Y'all, I'm exhausted. My eyes heavy. I'm tired. <laughs> But nevertheless, I had to come and every day I'm going to come live and talk about this Women's Day Jubilee because out of sight, out of mind. And I don't want y'all to forget about this. This is something that God is getting ready to shake and rattle the cages of Polk County. God is causing a shift in the atmosphere. Trust that. I feel it and I know it and I see it and I believe it. He's causing a shift in the atmosphere. The things that we used to do, guess what? It ain't appealing no more. I just told you I went to an event and I'm like, okay. And I had, I left early because I'm like, 
I, I want something different. I want to do something more. I want women to know grown and sexy is not just revealing everything that you have, all your assets. No, it goes deeper than that. It's about beauty and brains. This is what's going to take us to the next level. Not the tight dress that's, dresses that we're wearing. Not the low cut dresses. None of that stuff. And I'm not knocking nobody. Come on now. I'm not knocking anybody. But what I'm saying is... I'm at that age now. I'll be 49 years old in August. Thank you, Jesus. Because I was sick, got sick last year. And I didn't even know if I was going to make it last year. But nevertheless, my mindset has changed totally. And I'm not saying everybody else's mindset has to change or you may not want it. And that's okay. That's fine. But what I'm saying is it's time for us to level up, get up, grow up, and step up to what it is that we supposed to be. And quit playing ourselves short. I don't care if it's about your, with your friends, the man you with, the husband. I don't care nothing about that. You know that there is something about you that you're unhappy with. And it's time for you to address that situation and come face to face with that and step up to where you supposed to be in life. And it's not about pleasing or satisfying anybody else. It's about you and God. And God is tugging at your heart and he's telling you certain things that you need to do. You got a lot of influence in your community and you can make a difference we got a lot of young girls watching us and what are we telling these girls what are we teaching these girls what are we training yeah they may not be your physical daughter no you may not have given birth to them but guess what the elder women the wise women the aged women the seasoned women that is our job and our duty to teach our young girls but what are our young girls doing if you look around what are our girls they learning off of loving hip-hop they learning off of loving hip hop. And some of us act like we learning off of loving hip hop. And like I said, I'm not coming here to knock anybody on how anybody do what they do. That's between you and God. But what I'm saying is God is causing a shift in my life. God is causing a shift for me to want to do better, to make a difference and not just make noise, but make a movement, make a movement because we could talk all day. Words ain't nothing. It's about your actions. So now it's time for me to put my money where my mouth is. Yeah, I could talk all day and have a good game about me, but it's time for me to put my money where my mouth is. So instead of me always making statements and little quotes that I put on social media. Yeah. Okay, Misha. Now, what are you going to do about it? Okay. You tell us we can and we will. Okay. What are you going to do about it? What are you hosting? What are you promoting? And that's the difference. Because a lot of times your words are who you pretend to be, but your actions say who you really are. So now it's time for me to put my actions, my actions, yeah, my actions, my words to actions. Yeah, that's what it's time for. So I'm asking you to join me with the Women's Day Jubilee. Join me with the Women's Day Jubilee so that we, it's power in numbers that we, not just me, but we can come together on one accord and make a difference in our households, in our communities, in our state, in our city, and most of all, in our own personal lives. I'm asking my sisters to join forces with me that we can turn around and make a difference because yeah, one person can do something and make a difference, but baby, there's power in numbers. He said, where well, there's two or three touching and agreeing, he what in the midst. And if he's in the midst, you already know it's going to get done. It's going to get done, but I need my sisters to come together. Not a click thing, y'all. We ain't about that no more. It's about us coming together on one accord to make a difference in our communities, make a difference in our households, because our children are falling by the wayside, y'all. Yeah. And I'm not blaming the TV because guess what? We turn on the TV for them to watch. I'm not blaming the music. Why? Because we turn on the music for them to listen to the music. And then we turn around and they see what we do. They hear us talking on the phone. They hear us gossiping. So now it's time for us to call structure. Structure in our lives so that we could be better for our children and our grandchildren and our nieces and our nephews. Yeah, and our siblings. It's time for us to step up, y'all. So this is what the day of with the Women's Jubilee is about. It's stepping out of that 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 transition of of what society say we are. We're more than baby makers. We more than welfare uh, a welfare um dependents. Yeah, we're more than that. We're entrepreneurs. We're business women. We're beauty and brains, baby. 
but we got to prove that to them. They say we poor, but we're not poor because that's why they keep coming in our communities. We just mismanage money, but we're millionaires and we got to speak that and believe that. Yeah. And it's going to take more than just my voice. That one voice. It's going to take more than that. Yeah. So it's time for us to get together on one accord so that we can make a difference and show them the power of sisters. All right, guys. So again, if you want to be a part of this, it's $25 for the ticket. And that's for you to attend. If you want to be a vendor, then it is $50 for you to attend. If you want to be a sponsor, you just whatever gift you want to you want to bless the Women's Day Jubilee with. And make sure on your cash app, you put it what it is that you're paying for. So if you're purchasing a ticket, put ticket um, for the event. If you're being a sponsor, put sponsor. And if it's for your business that you're sponsoring, then make sure you put your business name on there as well. So that when I do turn around and give the shout outs and for every business person, I'm going to ask that you send me a, a logo with the PDF so that I can post it and let people know you helped us reach our goal to where we want to be. Okay, guys. And then if you want to be a vendor, make sure you put vendor on there. We only have a few spots left for vendors. Um, so hit me up and let me know what it is that you want to do. I thank you so much for your time always. Cause you know, I go to jibber jabbering and I'm exhausted and tired. I got to get up early in the morning and hit the pavement again. But until we talk again, I love you guys. And I wish nothing but blessings on top of blessings, on top of blessings, on top of blessings. I'll talk to you later, guys. Good night.